In December 2014, the Natural History Museum unveiled the most complete stegosaurus specimen ever to be discovered. But that wasn't the only stegosaur specimen on display here. Paul, what are we stood in front of? This is an animal called Dacenturus, and Dacenturus is actually the first stegosaur to ever be scientifically described. Whereabouts was this specimen found as well? This is actually from right here in the UK, from the rather unexotic locality of Swindon. <laughs> when it was first discovered, what did it tell paleontologists of the day? Well, this is the first one ever found, so it was the roadmap for understanding what stegosaurs look like. And what we're looking at is basically the hip and the back leg and just a few bits of the backbone of this animal. When we look at new specimens like Sophie that was unveiled, does it help looking at these older specimens to get a better idea of the animals? It does. We always go to these historical specimens for reference. By applying new technologies or just looking at these things with fresh eyes, we find a lot of new information on these historical specimens. So you're building on the past using these older specimens to better understand new specimens? 